Hi, Rodney here. This is another example showing how to lie with statistics. It's another one of those demonstrations implemented using Excel. Let's say you are investigating the effect of beer consumption on health and you've collected data on the volume of beer consumed in a regional town per week and the number of patients that are admitted to the local hospital per week. And you've done it for the last 20 weeks and here's the data over here. So in that week, the week Week, uh, the first week there are 193 patients admitted to the hospital and 11 cubic metres of beer were consumed. So is beer good for you? Well, it is a graph showing the relationship between those two variables and if you click that button it shows a clear trend downwards as the volume of beer increases, the number of patients in, uh, decreases. So it looks like beer is good for you. Wrong. This is an example where the, you can get the wrong result, you can draw the wrong conclusion by ignoring port, important sources of variation. The import, other variable, there's another important variable that I've ignored in that analysis there, and you might spot it, there it is there, season. And if you incorporate season, it's just a incorporate season into the picture all it does the points don't change you can just see the color changes to indicate the season variable and now you can see if you add in the trend lines that there's no relationship between the volume of beer consumed and the number of patients patients in the hospital it's season that's affecting both variables in summer there's more beer consumed than in winter and in winter there are more patients admitted to the hospital than in summer probably because of footy so this is uh, a, 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 um, an example where ignoring important sources of variation uh, if you ignore important sources of variation, you can draw the wrong conclusion. You might uh, like to try other, there are plenty of other examples and activities, learning activities just like that one on these various sheets. You can find them all and many more by going to that web page and downloading practical statistics. There's a lot more workbooks and there's a lot more learning activities. Bye.